A couple of days ago, we had an ambassador from Costa Rica to deliver all these wonderful books. Uh, uh, her name was uh, Luz Ovando, and she came down and just dropped off all these wonderful books. Uh, we have La Jaula, which is a special meaning for me, and I'll explain to you later. We have La Muñeca, which is this light blue color here, La Muñeca de Emilia, El Bosque de Que Desapareció, y el otro librito que se llama El Cambio del Planeta. I'm sorry, but I'm mixing the Spanish in the talk. Uh, panic that changed. Ch it's about climate change. Uh, anyway, the story goes that <coughs> a three-year-old memorized this book, 260 words, 20, 26 pages. And um, I, tried a book, I tried to purchase the book three years ago. I couldn't find anything on the internet. Now, folks, you can go to it on the web on Amazon and you can buy La Muñeca de Emilia for $9.99 on Amazon. Um, all these books were given to us free for the bilingual school. We're going to hand them over to the students this afternoon. And the story goes that I did film my daughter at the age of three memorizing this book and somehow it ended up at the authors and the lady that does the illustrations. So it's a couple from Europe, uh, he's from France and she's from Sweden, carrying, holding, I can't pronounce it, Spinelli, so it's a, he's a Christian Spinelli, uh, he's a French but with an with a Italian last name, and they give away these books uh, uh, as a non-profit, so they don't make any money by giving away the books. And uh, we're going to hand them over to the second graders today because those kids already know how to read and write. And we also have uh, some folks from Key West that are going to be they're going to be singing for them today. And we're going to have a celebration over these books that we're going to hand over to the students today. Uh, anyway, thanks for Itzel, my little daughter, that at the age of three, with her incredible memory, was able to memorize uh, one of these books. Uh, and me trying to find the book because I wanted to buy a few of them. And the book is out of print. It's called La Howl. Again, this is the book here. It's about birds teaching kids not to have birds in, in cages. I bought it at Sohavi in Costa Rica four years ago. Anyway, so we'll keep on going and go to the bilingual school and see what they're doing with the kids and the singing that will be going on. Today is also a special day because it's the first day of class. Of the school. We have three grades, kindergarten, first graders, and second graders. And it's a very important day for us today, so we'll head out there and see what's going on with uh, estaba colgado de una de las ramas altas llena de pájaros mi padre y rompió la ola en el pedazo con todas sus amigas todo lo corrido y ellos pensaron que era una suerte que solo había sido un sueño Time is short. 